In this part of our design workflow in Divi 5, I'm going to show you how to use your pre-made layouts to design your pages. All right, so let's use our existing sample page. By the way, I have installed Divi and you can see it right here. I'm running the latest version and I'm also logged in to make sure that I receive updates. All right, so let's head over now to our pages and I'm going to use an existing page here, which is called sample page. I'm going to say edit with Divi. So, of course, it has this uh, default, you know, uh, information here. We're going to get rid of all of that. And then we're going to click on this plus button. Now, here we have this option which says pre-made layout. So there's a ton of layouts we can choose from. As you can see, there's a lot. We can even drill down. We can go into just the business alone. We can go into education like that. So depending on what you're building, you can uh, zone in and really choose what you want to work on. So in this example, I want to use something very, very basic, although I can choose quite a lot from here. Now, sometimes if you need to, you can actually search for this. So you can say plumbing, for example. And that's if you want to quickly set up a page for a plumbing service. OK, so there we go. So you can see we have all our pages here. So let's say we want to add a basic landing page. So which one should we go with? OK, let's go with this uh, home page here. So I'm going to click once on it and then I'm going to say use this layout. OK, so you just click once. It's got an option here to import presets. So if you want to import the presets, you can uh, leave this uh, as it is. But if you don't, you can just uncheck it and then click on import. So what happens now is that design we saw is now imported onto our website and pretty much we are really good to go. So if we come over here now, you'll notice that we don't have any presets. So even if we click here, you can see that our presets have not been installed. But what this means is we have a fully functioning page. So let's save this page, do a quick preview so we can take a look. In fact, this is one of those uh, quick ways of, you know, putting together a website super fast. Now, for me, I don't I don't really like designing websites this way. I prefer going in and setting up everything myself. So here you can see we've set up this landing page. You can then go ahead and click another page. So I'm going to say new page. And this time I am going to name this contact. So you have to go through this process of setting up all these pages. But of course, you have to make sure you're choosing these pages from the same one from the same layout pack so that you have consistency. So again, I'm going to search for plumbing like that. And did we say contact? Yes, I think we said contact. So here's our contact page. You would click here. If you want to have a look at a demo, you would click that. It opens up a new page. And this is where it will give you a complete demo of what this uh, looks like. And once you're happy with that, you go back in here and then you say use this layout. And before you know it, we have a layout. In fact, we have to uncheck this and then say import. So before you know it, we have a layout. Our page has been designed again. We're going to publish this and do a quick preview. And sure enough, it's going to look like the preview that we had just like that. OK, so this is one of those ways you can design a website really fast using our pre-made layouts. At this stage, all you have to do now is to go in, change the images, change the colors to match your colors, and you are pretty much good to go.